It's a natural thing to care. Back in the day, to make the entire body feel better, they would get you a little bit of castor oil, a little bit of lemon, a little bit of orange, and take that, warm it up. It was just natural. Here's me, born to be a CEO, right? Look at me. <laughs> oh, and here's my grandmother. She started the old-fashioned rub down, they call it the healing touch. Taking castor oil and a little ointment and rub your feet. And then she passed it on to my mother. All those aromas came out of that stove. As I grew older, she would say, hey, Gloria, let me show you how to do this. And then all of a sudden, that natural thing that you saw became my purpose. My mother would say, she would tell me to stay focused. I just know that the touch, human touch is healing. And if I could just figure out a way to let other people do the same thing at home or bring those aromas that had the same memories that I have, they could feel the same way. How was that? Was that wonderful or what? So I got my own business and I finally got into being a freelance nail tech at the Oprah Show one day a week. I had no clue what was about to happen to my life. Hi everybody, it's Oprah getting my feet done, and that's Gloria, who's done my feet for years, who now has become the Foot Nanny at footnanny.com. All of a sudden, your responsibility becomes even bigger. I was just bursting at the scenes with sales for Amazon. It was all around the world. It was Florida, Ohio, Michigan, Texas, Canada, Japan, Italy. It was crazy. <laughs> And I had no space to put the cases of orders. And I said, I need more room and I need more help. It's like my brain is working along with whatever Amazon is going with. It just felt right. I just felt like I'd done something that my grandmother passed to my mother and then passed to me. And now me passing it to the world. My mother would say, if she saw this today, I'm extremely proud of you and I knew you always had it.